Hey, you guys. Welcome back to Married to Film. Listen, here's part two. This picture's a little blurry. I'm sure you recognize him. Tommy Walsh, primary suspect in the casino arson investigation. You were working him as a CI? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Is my client a murder suspect? What are we talking about? You found out Tommy was working for us and got your cartel to solve the problem. What? So was Kate Lane once murdered. Are they accusing me of money laundering or staging this hit? Both. You really think I'm capable of doing that? Who else have you floated this theory by? Right. Cosmo? Well, he's not a killer. Frank Jr.? You know I can't share the details of an ongoing investigation. That piece of shit was working our kids this entire time. Do you know that he was actually trying to fuck my teenage daughter? Right. Mm-hmm. They're just trying to get that KC mom to turn on us. I know. Smokers out anywhere they can. So, get a new phone. Call Wendy. Tell her to sweep the house for bugs. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. He getting drunk. Oh, God, Ruth. Uh-oh. Hey. Hey! What? You're not going to fucking get away with it. What are you talking about? You killed my friend. Shh. Keep your fucking voice down. I don't know what you're talking about. That fed told me that Tommy was a snitch and Marty had him killed. What? And you set him up. Wow. Wait, what? You knew. You fucking knew. So you had them killed. That's why you switched locations. What? Listen to me. I'm sorry about your friends. I really am, but I didn't kill them. I was in charge of them. Oh. You're drunk, and you need to go home. Don't touch You em. think I wanted to be here dealing with you? My fucking dad giving me a bullshit babysitting job, and I can't even keep them safe? I'm sorry. Go home. Sam, what's, what's up? Audience. Something weird's going on. And if they just phone. came up to me and started asking me for all sorts of records. What do I do? Uh, just, uh, just, um, stop what you're doing and, and cash out your chips. Wait, no. When you said that this is okay? Uh, it is. It's, it's okay. Okay, well, it doesn't feel very okay. They're just trying to spook you. These agents, they've got, they've got quotas and, um, low-hanging fruit gets the job done, okay? What's going on? Reese in the hospital. You didn't tell me what the hell's going on between you guys. Three is about to go up. It's complicated. 
Yep, she's banged up pretty bad. Broken ribs, internal bleeding. Thanks for letting me know. Wow. He made a mistake. Get out of the car. This is his mistake. The kid lost three of his friends. He wasn't thinking straight. He's not a fucking kid. He's a grown man. He beat the shit out of a girl half his size. She was part of my family. You know that? And those boys were part of my son's family. Who cares? Or is that right? Because one of them was a CI. Right. You want me to get my fucking house in order? If I had known. Yeah, whatever. Mm -hmm. I would have handled it myself. And how well. much did that kid already give to the feds? you have any idea? Mm-hmm. Was he wearing a wire? Was anybody else compromised? Cooler heads, Marty. Remember? No. Fuck that. <laughs> you can't control your son, and you didn't know Tommy was a snitch. You're mm. a fucking liability. Mm. We're done. That's it. You really want to do this? Yes! You come anywhere near me, my family, or Ruth again, the next time you see your son, he's going to be hanging from a bridge in Juarez. You got that? This must be a stressful time for you and your husband, given that three of your employees died in that attack. Well, they were they were contractors. They were, they were not employees, but... Yes. We're reeling. Tell me about this charitable foundation you're starting. Given the PR crisis you're facing and your connection to a diehard conservative like Charles Wilkes. Well, you have every right to have reservations. And look, I'm no fan of Charles's politics, but uh, uh, Missouri is tilting red and reaching across the aisle is the only way to get anything done. Because what you need is political cachet. Are you familiar with a company named Blank Check? They wiped out a lot of families in this community when we were researching loan services for our casino, we came across some internal documents from Blink's CEO, cause for another lawsuit if they ever came to light. Uh -huh. Could be useful. The publicity certainly wouldn't hurt. I think I could be of service. I bet you can. All right. Did you hear that? I think I might have been wrong about you. No, Agent Evans did this. You sat there, you listened to his lies, you lift a finger to stop it. You might as well kick the shit out for yourself, you know that? So now you're going around, you're intimidating gamblers on my floor. You want me to be your asset, you learn how to be a better handler. Mm. The Sam Dermody know you're using him to launder money, you take advantage of him like everybody else. Until you're straight with me, I'm gonna keep coming after you. Whoa. Mm. Ew, God. <laughs> you gonna tell me what happened between you and Ruth? Don't tell me it's complicated. You got more language in you than that. She killed my dad. And my uncle Boyd. Electrocuted them in the dock of the blue cat. I killed my husband. Right. Maybe she had a good reason. Uh-oh. Mm. Did it to protect Marty Bird. Oh. If that's the case, your quarrel is not with your cousin, it's with Bird. That man is a disease. He worms his way in, gets his hooks into people and changes them so they forget who they are. And I saw it happen right in front of me with Jacob. Oh my God. Man I love for 40 years. Like a, a part of me. I watched him turn into something that I, I didn't even recognize. He knew it too. He just wasn't strong enough to fight it himself. So I had to put him down. And that's why I had to kill him. Mm-hmm. Uh-uh. 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 What? She said he had a heart attack. He did. Just wasn't entirely natural. <laughs> Once the birds turned him against me. It was just a matter of time before he turned his back on everything else we built. I couldn't just stand by and watch that. Look, like, uh, I gotta get out of here. You wanna leave? No, no it's just a lot. No, no. Lord knows I miss him. Well, don't let her fix you no But every time I feel a pang of regret, I remind myself that the man I love disappeared long before I slipped those cherry pits into his coffee. Cherry pits. No more coffee from you. Okay. <laughs> Go and see your cousin. Was this hell, huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, 
Oh, you are dead. Yeah. Because. So, tell me, how long have you been the Bird family's lawyer? About a year. How long have you been their therapist? Well, I'm afraid I'm not at liberty to say. Patient confidentiality and all. Hey, wake up.